Hey guys, it's me, Amaya, and I know you're like, this is not Mr. Jackson Maniac. If you don't know, that's a book series on my channel that I haven't finished. Well, I sort of lost Mr. Jackson Maniac, so I decided, so if you really are like, I really want to see the last chapter, then I would suggest buying it yourself, because I don't know how long it will be till I find it. But if I do find it, I will hopefully do the last part. So, but I'm going to start a new book series. It's called Unicorn Diaries. And this is, this is kind of like a comic book. So, I think it'll be fun to read. <clears throat> Chapter 1. Nice to meet you. Sun. So, this is on Sunday. This is actually the day I'm recording this on. Hello, new diary. We're going to be the best of friends. But first, you know all about me. So, here we go. My name is Rainbow Tens Tail. Everyone calls me Bo. Here's a picture. This book has a lot of pictures in it, so you'll see me showing it a lot. I live in, in Sparkle Grove Forest. Lots of magical creatures live here. So, as you can see, there's Rainbow Falls. It's like a waterfall. Tro Troll Caves. Ooh. Glimmer Glade. This is kind of like this forest area. Sparkle Grove Unicorn School for Unicorns. As it said, it's a school for unicorns. Um, Dragon's Nest. I'm trying to read it from this angle. Bumble Meadow. Looks like a type of meadow. And over here on this page, we have Snowbell Mountains. Unipods. Fairy Village. Twinkle Lock Lagoon. Oh, hold on, my cat's at the door. All right. So you might see Midnight. I'm not sure if you can see her, but I think you can see her black tail. Yep. Might see her popping in and out. She likes to just come in when I'm doing, especially my reading videos. I noticed that she has to come in during my reading videos. But anyway, lots of magical creatures live here. Like trolls. Here are four things I know about trolls. They live in caves. They set up necks to crack anyone who gets near their caves. They do not like getting wet. And they love moldy cheese. Look, Yuck. Now back to me. I am a unicorn. So, there. You know what, for this, I think I'm going to have it facing downward. That way you can, this book kind of has a lot of labels. Horn makes a great nightlight. Good for pointing to things. Rainbow Mane keeps our necks warm and looks pretty. Nose can sneeze glitter. I never knew that. Tail switching it makes our unicorn power work. Perfect for swatting any away flies. Horses do that too. You probably know this, but if you don't, horses um use their tail to swat away flies. Because flies are one of the most annoying creatures on the earth. Unicorns are so much more than a sparkling horn. Here are some fun facts. One, we each have a different unicorn power. I am a wish unicorn. I can grant one wish every week. Two, we glow and we're nervous. I didn't know that. Hi, midnight. Three, we sleep on small floating clouds. Our snoring sounds like music. And four, we eat brightly colored food. So, basically, they don't like pastels. Not sure if they'll be a me then. I like neons on occasions, but I also love pastels. So, you can tell from my bracelets. I mean, they all are pastel color. Oh, this was a YouTube live. Oh, yeah. I live, in Sparkle Gro I live at Sparkle Grove School for Unicorns. SSU. It's the best school in the world. This is Mr. Rump Rumpwinkle. He looks after us and teaches us how to be better unicorns. I have lots of friends. Here is outside of our unipod where we sleep. I'm going to go ahead and read the bottom text before I show you all these. My, my friends are my family. This is because unicorns don't have mom or dad. Really? That's sad. We're not born like other creatures. We just pop in the world like really starry nights. Oh, that's kind of weird. I had never... I'm learning some new stuff about unicorns today. So, this is Scarlet Sugar Lump, right here. 
Nutmeg Sil Silver Rip, Jet Glitter Rock, Monty Dumpling, that's that's Bo, and Piper Forenstein. Okay, interesting names. Never heard of those names. I'm not sure if I would be someone named Sugar Lumps, but if I do, and their name's Scarlet, they will become my unicorn best friend. We study twinkle-tastic subjects like magical movement and music, mane and tail styling, creatures that sparkle grow for us, use of unicorn powers. Remember how I said we appeared on really starry nights? That's a su There's a super twinkly sky tonight. I hope there'll be a new unicorn tomorrow. Diary, can I tell you something? Yeah. I mean, it's your diary, so. I've never really had a best friend. How would it be if a new unicorn turned out to be my bestie? My hooves are crossed. Instead of finger crossed, it's your hooves. So, like, my toes are crossed. That would be kind of weird. Here's the picture. Chapter 2. See how the chapter's a little quicker? I, I kind of spent some time talking like I am doing right now, but still. Midnight's listening to. Monday. I have a I have clearly good news, Diary. Guess what happened on the forest last night? A brand new unicorn. He tried to our classroom and knocked over Mr. Rumperwickle's desk. Ooh, that's the teacher. The new unicorn laughed. So, so we did too. I guess he's a bit clumsy. Students, I'd like you to meet Sonny Hunkleberry. I'm sure you remember how scary it was when you were new, so please be kind to Sonny and help him find his way around. Um, hi. Hi, Sonny. We told him our names. Not good for the whole teacher. Am I that rude? Yes, you did. Sonny sat next to me. Yay! Then Mr. Rumperwickle gave Sonny a patch blanket. I explained how each week we had a new patch for our blankets. Then when our blankets are full, full, we're ready to leave school. Mr. Rumperwickle always announces what the new patch will be on Monday. Give us patches on Fridays at the patch parade. This week's patch will be the Unicorn Power Patch. To earn your patch, you will have to. You will each use your unique unicorn power to help another creature. This will be an easy patch for me to get. All I have to do is grant someone a wish who needs it. Remember, she's a wish unicorn. You get a wish once a week. We were all so excited to use our unicorn powers this week. We told Sunny all about our different powers. I'm a healer unicorn. I can make you feel better. I'm a thingabob unicorn. If you need something, you can find it in my mane. I'm a flying unicorn. I'm a weather unicorn. If you want to snow, just ask me. I'm a size changing unicorn. Whoa, that's kind of cool. <clears throat> Finally, it was my turn. I'm a wish unicorn. I can grant one wish, one wish every week. So, is there anything you need? Would you like to wish for anything at all? Let me know. To our surprise, a mouse spoke up next. I'm a shape different unicorn. So, like, it's a unicorn, but you shake it into a into a into um a mouse. And guess who that mouse is? It was Mr. Rumperwickle, of course. He always makes us jump when he does that. Sonny, what's your unicorn power? I don't know. Really? We knew it right away. Me too! Sonny doesn't know his unicorn power? But it might be kind of hard for his unicorn patch because he doesn't even know. Speak froze. He doesn't even know! I'm trying to get it unfrozen. So I, I can show you the picture. He doesn't even know his power. So it's going to be kind of hard for him to have his unicorn patch. There we go. It's all right, Sonny. Most, but not all, unicorns know their power as soon as they appear. This might take a little longer to find yours. This Sonny sneezed and knocked over three desks. Oops, well, I know my unicorn power is not keeping things neat and tidy. At cloud time, I think cloud tide is like nap time because they look, because they're sleeping on clouds. I hope Sonny asked me for a wish to use his power. That would help him, and I would get my patch. Yeah, but you can't tell people what to wish for, remember? That's not how your power works. I know. I just really hope Sonny makes a wish. All right, continuing on. 
Sonny sleeps in the cloud next to mine. He's so funny. He's already snoring. When people snore, it's like, and you're like right next to them, and like, it's like super loud. Oh, that's that sucks. All right. I think this will be a short one because um, there's only six chapters, and this and the chapters are really short. So I think I'm gonna stop here in chapter three. And we'll do the other ones next time. But I hope that you enjoyed this book. Again, sorry I couldn't finish Mr. Jackson Maniac. But if I find it, I will definitely um, read it to you. But I hope you are enjoying um, Unicorn Diaries. And hopefully Sonny will find his powers. But if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe to my Playtime. So we have more fun time. So that way we have more fun time playing together. See you next time. Bye, everybody.